Cheers! When starting with a new hobby and looking around for materials the very first time, one can easily be overwhelmed by all the things to choose from, and the price tag on your newfound hobby can rise pretty quick. So, looking back, I can honestly say I would have preferred to have somewhat better information when I picked up the oil painting for the first time. That would have given me a better introduction, probably also a more effective learning curve, and maybe even spared me some confusion in coins on the way. If you're thinking about to start painting oil, it's a good thing to know what colors and material one maybe should start with. There is a few different brushes one can need at the beginning. One usually just pick a few and one can came a long way with that, depending on what quality you buy of course. But the colors is a different beast altogether. I think the Zone palette is a great set of colors to start off with to get to know the colors and the medium before one decides to kick in the gate to the rainbow. It's easy to overbuy in colors and just randomly smear it into green grey mud on the canvas and painting the first time. That can be a huge turn off and can easily end up with that all the paint and brushes find their way into a drawer somewhere to be found by one of your grandchildren years later. Anyhow, I am convinced that no matter what hobby or craft you get into, you should go for quality to get the best experience from the get-go and same goes for the oil painting. Because it do differ if you got a real set of brushes and some smooth nice colors and fine canvas instead of something that behaves like an old toothbrush and some poor tubes of paint on a piece of paper or whatnot. A canvas and four colors, yellow ochre, ivory black, cadmium red and titanium white and a small vial of linen oil to thin out the paint if needed is a great start and something you're coming a long way with. Filbert is a brush good for smooth blending, round brush for thin to thick like hair, a flat brush to applicate paint and straight edges. Blue is a color you probably will notice that you miss first. So ultramarine goes great with the palette. And after that, keep present a new color to the palette when it feels right and you feel the need for it. Of course, depending on what you're going to paint, you will need different colors. But I still think the zone palette is a good base for a good introduction into oil painting. I would recommend to start to do a color chart on something like a sheep 30 times 20 centimeter panel as an exercise. It will also be good to have as color reference while painting until you learn the blending of the colors by head. Randomly mixing paint on your palette can be an expensive story and much paint can end up in the trash. Put the leftover paint in a box into the freezer until you need them for your next painting. It holds longer in there, but not forever. It would be a shame if you start your journey with throwing away good paint. If you don't have time or just don't want to do this exercise and want to start to paint right away, it's just as fine. Create is all about freedom, a freedom of expression. I have only just presented an approach on how I wish I got introduced into oil painting. I guess it's just as many brush strokes on heaven as it is to get into painting a smooth way. Until next time, express yourself.